Road Rash was released in September 1991 on the Sega Genesis. Later releases included the Amiga and PC, which is what this one's all about. However, the Classics version won't install on the 64-bit version of Windows 10. But if you try and install it, this is the error message that you get. However, in, there has been a fix for it, and if you download this file here, plus the Road Rash ISO image, there's an installer folder here, and then double click on the roadrash.exe file to install the actual game. When starting the game, it showed quickly showed never that it couldn't find MIDI files. The game would play, but no sound files. So to get around this, go and uh, mount the ISO image, double click on the Road Rash directory that's in the folders, and then copy the audio data images and text folders where the game was actually installed. However, you'll then see some graphical glitches are shown here. This is fixed by creating a batch file with the following and saved in the install folder and run from there. This is uh, Road Rash on my arcade machine. Now, I've had some issues before, as you could see from my video, which hopefully I'll have done by now anyway. Um, but this is it actually working properly. You know, so you've got your bulletin board, screws, restroom on the street, bulletin board, pick which thing you want. And obviously Napa Valley is going to be the next one anyway. Um, but as you see when you start it up, does the video intro. I said it's all on my arcade machine, look, my little fingers there, and the game, bum 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 bum, and when it comes up, there we go. So it basically gives you a, um, you know, on the screen, a bit darker, but then once you start playing, it plays okay, but as you can tell from the other picture, the corruption stuff, uh, sort of perfectly, I mean, I tried one game, the first race I had was working fine, it looked like this, and then the second race I had, it looked like the other, with the uh, corrupted graphics, so... Um, the batch file that I created has helped immensely and it works perfectly now so I'm really pleased so hopefully uh, the tips have been useful for you as well I hope you enjoy playing Road Rash again oh and in case anybody's wondering uh, yes I do have the original Road Rash put it on the side da -da -da -da. Windows 95 classics love the game bit limited now though with only five different levels but hey what can you can't complain because it was done in like you know years ago Thanks very much for watching this video hope you enjoyed it um, if you liked it give a thumbs up and consider subscribing because I'd like to do some live things uh, at some point and I need a thousand subscribers so that would be great what do you think mm. yes I agree mm.